Good morning. Good morning. It's great to stay up late. Good morning. Good morning <laughs> to you. Someone's perky. Well, you know me. I'm just happy to be at work, aren't I? Yeah, he's just happy to get his grubby little hands on the big bonus from the American deal. Is that a crime? It certainly isn't. And you'll be happy to know I'll be signing the contract today so you can all start thinking about what you'll be spending those bonuses on. Ooh. <laughs> I'm starting to think we should have put God and Gecko in charge yonks ago. Do you know you're that fickle, you? Come on! <laughs> yeah, I just want to learn as much as I can. Oh, I was exactly the same at your age. Yeah, well, I was thinking maybe we could do, like, a shadowing scheme where I sit in some of your meetings, you know, learn from the master. Uh, sorry if I'm interrupted. That's fine. Uh, can we pick this up later, Michael? Yeah, sure. That's nothing, really. I just just found these in the flat. I thought we might need them. Thank you. Hey, listen, uh, how is she? That was just on my way to see her. Hi, Peter. Hey. How's she doing? Early days. Well, give her my love, won't you? Oh, well, sure, thanks. Yeah. And look, when we voted for him to be put in charge, that was no reflection on her as a person, was it? You know how much we look up to her. Would happen. I thought you and Sarah would cover for her. I didn't expect you lot to just officially oust her. It wasn't like that. Oh, dear. Look, I thought you'd already told him. I haven't had a chance. Peter, please, just let Listen, him this explain. is your doing, isn't it? You and the rest of these so-called 50 centers. You just vote her out of her own company. No, we did what we thought was best for the business. Oh, come on, Peter. You know how much we love Carla? You lot have only got them shares because she gave them to you, and this is what you do. This is how you repay that kindness, is it? Peter. Come on. Someone needed to run the factory while she was away. While she was away? She's not sunning herself in the Maldives. She's in a private clinic trying to sort out her mental health problems. We didn't know how much time she needed. Maybe she should focus on getting better. Look, there's a lot of people in this place that are depending on their wages. Oh, well, as long as you're all right, eh? That's all that matters. Have I come at a bad time? I do apologize. Yes. Sorry, could you come back a little later? Uh, I appreciate it. I'll, I'll drop you a text. Of course. I'll look forward to it. Good work today, everybody. See you tomorrow. Yes? I didn't get your text. So I thought I'd check you were still here. What do you want? Straight to business, eh? OK. I want exclusivity to Nipper Snapper. You already have that. Unfortunately, divorce is expensive. I need to enter the US market and I don't need any competition. Well, what does that have to do with me? I've already secured my US client. I've got the contract here waiting to be signed. Yeah, you need to tear that up. <laughs> what? Or I'll tell your workforce just why their lady boss has been acting so weird lately. Your choice. Let me know when it's done. Sorry to interrupt. Nah, you're not interrupting anything. I'm just off. Let me know what you decide, yeah? I'll be in touch. I, uh, I thought everyone had gone. Oh, yeah. No, but I, I came back because I realised I hadn't told you that I sent off the projections of the US deal. Oh, well, uh, that can wait till tomorrow. What, you sure? Yeah. All right. Well, see you later. See ya. <laughs> <laughs> 